over 7,000%. Mara reports earnings, shares are falling in after hours. Let's take a look at Mara and compare it to another miner that had very similar earnings very recently. So we have the Marathon Digital Report right here. The numbers aren't on TradingView yet, so I'll have to switch back and forth to get a view of how that looks. Anyways, you can see that revenue here was 165.2 million for the quarter. If we go to TradingView here, you can see the, that the expected amount of revenue was $182 million. So that was a miss. So they missed on revenue by a few percentage points there. But, but per diluted share, you've got a EPS of $1.00. 26 cents versus an expectation of 1.9 cents. So that was a huge, huge beat on the EPS. Uh, now, of course, that is with the new accounting rules. So they won't get tons of benefit from that massive beat on the earnings per share, but at least that was positive. But all numbers are growth from year over year. Year over year, the growth is, is enormous. So they're moving in the right direction in that way. Uh, but you can see that since after hours here, we ended at this price here, 1966, and it came as low as 1860, with, which means that during this candle that we're in on after hours right now, we saw a drop of 5.33% on this thing. And after an initial pop of 4.55, so we went up 4.55%, then down 5 point uh you know three three percent and now we're settling at about minus 1.57 percent in the after hours right now so this is a pretty mixed bag i am expecting to see it probably continue to drift down a bit on here uh, especially if i come over here let's go to riot riot had pretty similar earnings in terms of they beat on eps missed on revenue now let's take a look at that actually where is their earnings it was back here all right i mean screwing things up all right earnings yeah so they missed on their revenue but beat on their uh, eps and what happened with them let's see they came down for that day they opened up pretty far down and then went up and then flattened out so i'm expecting in the morning for us to open up about where we are currently now maybe a little further down maybe around 1880 to 1860 in the morning and from there charge up right now i am pretty happy that i sold those calls i had open on marathon that i sold them yesterday i'm pretty happy i did that I am going to try and let me get my box here. I'm going to try and reopen those calls somewhere in this box here. Let me just get this all the way there. Okay. I'm going to try to open it, reopen those calls somewhere inside of this box in the morning right away tomorrow. So I'll probably do that before I make my morning video. Uh, try to get one or two more calls again on Mara here and then maybe build the position if it comes down. But my expectation is that it'll come down to around this. Red line here, the 200 uh, hour SMA right there. Hit it again and perhaps bounce off of that, much like what Riot was doing, right? Where the earnings came in, it had a big blow off, blow up top here, came down, opened up pretty far down, and then started kind of just like chopping around and charging on up and following kind of a trend line there. I'll, I'll be looking for a trend line to be developed here. Perhaps it'll be off of this one here. We'll see. I'll look for it in the morning, but I'm looking to load up on some calls in between. Uh, about anywhere below $19, honestly, in the morning. And of course, this is not financial advice, not a suggestion to buy, sell, or hold any asset whatsoever. It's just what I'm thinking about doing potentially in the morning. We'll see if price um, participate, you know, if price uh, allows me to do that or not tomorrow morning. But that's it. That's the Mara earnings today. Let's see how CleanSpark cleaned out the day. Um, we closed out the day today for CleanSpark at, let's see at plus one three four percent and in after hours we are up another 1.9 percent in after hours for clean spark uh one little note here for clean spark at least on the hourly chart we do have some resistance here up at 1762 we do need to get above that again uh, in order to continue charging up but it does look like we have a nice cup and handle forming here uh in the hourly chart actually that's not bad at all let me turn off regular trading hours. Oh yeah, it's actually a really nice up and handle that we're looking at right here on the hourly chart. I don't usually dig down into the hourlies on the miners, but yeah, that's not bad. Right here, just this cup right there, handle. This thing breaks uh, and we get back above that price there, 1739. We get back above that. We're very 
likely looking at a nice move easily up to $18 and then potentially up to even $19 off of this handle there. That's pretty nice. Uh, great. Uh, I'll keep my eyes on that. So I'll be looking at the uh, hour, uh, the hourly chart on CleanSpark here going forward. Uh, on Mara, I'm not seeing anything like that on Mara. It's just showing that down move, down move, down move right now. Just kind of like this is very aggressive and very controlled right here that it's been doing all day long. This is a controlled aggressive selling, which is honestly very, very similar to what we saw back here on the 7th. Very aggressive downtrend, followed by a little blip up, followed by further downtrend. So I'd be looking for a little bit of a blip up here in the pre-market, followed by a downtrend right before we open. Uh, that'll take us down into the 1860 range for Mara, where I'd be looking to pick up some calls for like, you know, December or January. That's what I'd be looking out for Mara. Uh, that's all I got for you today. Oh, oh, the numbers got posted on here. We can see the percentages. They beat earnings per share expectations by over 7,000%, but missed on revenue by 9%. They're going to be punished for this miss on revenue, but that this I just love to see. This is just a hilarious number. 7,000%. <laughs> what was it last time? It was also some ridiculous numbers. Over... 1800%, but they beat earnings per share by 7,000% for Mara. Uh, hopefully we see some benefit for that. Uh, uh, what was Clean Sparks beating? They beat it by 700%. Uh, so like Mara is killing it. Uh, let's take a look. What was Riots? Riots was 500%. So Mara is just amazing with their earnings per share there. That's pretty great. Love that. And that's all obviously because of their massive Bitcoin treasury compared to the other miners. That's why they have that 7,000% EPS growth here on that. That is fantastic to see. I love that. I absolutely love that. I'm going to be looking for yeah, a pickup of some calls here tomorrow. That's my plan. Uh, so anyways, with that said, please like, comment, and subscribe, and have a profitable day.